Remax made a great investment with our undercover slip here. You can see it has a, a new roof on it and an added addition. We closed in the size of the, uh, the, the hut to allow us to work on boats in the rain, in foul weather, if it's windy out. We do a lot of painting underneath that shed. We repair water leaks underneath that shed. So it's a great addition to the facility to allow us a nice dry area to work on our yachts. This is the lifeblood of, of our yard here. This is our 120 ton marine travel lift capable of uh, hauling boats out of the water that are 98 feet to 100 feet long. We're only restricted by the width of our haul out slip, which is 21 foot six beams. So we can haul out a, a wide array of yachts and the machine is state of the art. It can turn full 360 degrees on its own axis. All the wheels turn. The machine can go sideways so we can get boats in uh, tight areas and, and really stack the yard properly for maximum efficiency. We have a 60 foot Bertram here. We hauled it out for its uh, annual bottom job. You can see right now that the bottom's painted. The guys are preparing the running gear right now for the application of prop speed. We put that on the props and the propellers and we'll put Trilux on the struts, uh, trim tabs, and rudders. So the boat will be freshly painted, all barnacles removed, all through hull fittings cleaned out, and the guy's ready to start a season. This particular Azmit is a couple of years old. It's, it's not a newer model, but the owner is very particular and he keeps it in fantastic condition. Right now, it's in for a lot of cosmetic work. This model has teak cap rail on it that goes around the entire boat. We're stripping it down to bare wood and we're gonna apply 10 coats of varnish back on and then three coats of clear polyurethane. This here is an automotive spray booth and it allows us to paint various parts that are taken off the boat. It could be doors, window frames, hatches, anything that could fit through these two doors we would bring in here and we would be able to paint it in a clean environment. The air gets filtered out through those filters on the back wall there and then through another set of filters into the air. So we try to capture all the uh, paint that we put into the air with this uh, spray booth. Here we have our paint department. All our painters keep their e tools and equipment in this area. We have all explosion proof cabinets and uh, that is OSHA standard. We keep all the flammable material in the cabinets and it's all sectioned off. You can see we have the all craft cabinet here with the chrome base. We have another cabinet here that houses all the azimuth colors that the hulls come in painted on. We have another cabinet that has the Hatteras paints in it. This is Robert Diaz, uh, one of our top technicians, ABYC certified mechanic. Robert's over 30 years uh, experience. He shares that experience with the younger guys and loves to teach them and he's a great asset to our company. We are now in our fiberglass shop and I'm standing next to Paul, our fiberglass technician. Paul's been with the company for, for over 10 years now. Paul was a boat builder at one time in his earlier career. He owned his own shop. Uh, Paul's a tremendous asset here in our fiberglass shop. We just recently did a huge uh, uh, project where the struts and rudders were torn out of a boat and we had to work with a naval architect and a composite expert and put the boat back into boat manufacturer condition and Paul was instrumental in, in making that happen. We're standing here in the yard with two of our yard crew members. We have uh, Gene Mark and we have his brother Yonel uh, working here now. Gene Mark in the yard, he's known as my son. Uh, every time I'm out in the yard I'll, and I'm looking for him, I'll say, where's my son, where's my son? And the guys know who I'm talking about and they'll go find him for me. The yard crew guys probably have the toughest job in this facility. These guys go in there, they put on their protective equipment, they get the job done, they come out smiling, and they never complain. Well, I think the team's great. There's a ton of experience. Our technicians range from guys that are just graduating from local marine colleges 
to technicians and bottom paint crew that have been doing this for 20 to 30 years. We're here now and we always will be. We're a sound company. No one really does what we do, and when we do it, uh, we do it right the first time.